The stars of hit Channel 4 show Gogglebox had plenty of opinions as they tuned into Oprah Winfrey's chat with Harry and Meghan. Dozens of Gogglebox fans have complained to Ofcom after watching the stars of show tune into the explosive Oprah Winfrey interview with Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Regular faces of the hit Channel 4 series were critical of the Duchess of Sussex as she opened up about life as a royal, and TV regulator Ofcom has since had 51 complaints about comments made. However, this was very little in comparison to the 4,398 complaints about the Oprah interview itself, and 57,121 over Piers Morgan's criticism of Meghan on ITV's Good Morning Britain. Among those reacting to the interview on Gogglebox were Blackpool, based brother and sister Pete and Sophie Sandiford. As the comedic siblings tuned into the Oprah chat, they were heard commenting on claims by Prince Harry that senior royals suggested Meghan should start acting again to cover their security costs after this was removed. Stick her in the gift shop while you're at it. You know, 30 hours a week in the gift shop, that should cover her funds. Sophie joked to her brother as they relaxed on their sofas. Fellow Gogglebox star Stephen Webb added, What did they want her to do? Get her a part in EastEnders. As he watched it alongside his husband. Another comment was made by Lee Riley as he watched Meghan tell Oprah that the easiest way that now people can understand it is what we've all gone through in lockdown. But Hull. Basley wasn't impressed and remarked, I weren't in a fucking 14 bedroom fucking castle. Watching it alongside him in the caravan, his best friend Jenny Newby added, We're stuck in here, love. You want to try it in here with us? The Gogglebox stars also had plenty to say in regards to Meghan's comments about racism and mental health. Referring to the racist claims, Pete said, I mean, this is going to have massive ramifications now for the royal family, because our perception of them is changing. And reacting to Meghan's claims that she couldn't get help for her mental health, Wiltshire, based Mary Killen commented, I can't believe that if the Queen knew how upset she was, the Queen wouldn't have insisted she had some help. The stars of the show were also shown watching a BBC News report the following evening, on March 9, which shared the statement issued from Buckingham Palace on behalf of the Queen. Sophie said of it, I wonder if they've actually watched it. I wonder if the Queen has sat down and watched Oprah. Speaking about the Queen promising to address the claims made by Meghan, Gogglebox star Micah then said, It's a start, but the problem I have is alright, you're going to address it privately, but I kind of feel Terry's something you might need to let us know publicly. According to the Mail Online, an Ofcom spokesman said, We are assessing the complaints against our broadcasting rules, but are yet to decide whether or not to investigate. They added, the complaints were about comments made about the royal family from participants whilst watching Oprah with Meghan and Harry. Gogglebox continues on Friday at 9 p.m. on Channel 4.